Welcome once again to Let Us Farm. My name is Emily Fonwell Oge of Let Us Farm. So today, we are going to be discussing a practical way to achieve 1 kg on body weight of our catfish in three and a half months. This, if you could, if you can listen to me very well, you can do this in three and a half months. But for this particular one we are talking about, I want to use 100 juveniles to give an illustration. So in subsequent one, I'm also going to use 1,000 to give an illustration. But for today, we are going to be discussing using 100 juveniles to achieve minimum weight of 1 kg in three and a half months. Is this possible? Yes. So before we go on, may I use this opportunity to remind us that this is Let Us Farm page. And all we discuss here is practical solutions to our agri problem. Now, if you've not followed us, kindly follow us on. We are on Facebook, Let Us Farm. We're also on Instagram, Let Us Farm. Then you can subscribe to our YouTube channel, Let Us Farm. And we're on TikTok let us farm so follow us in all cross board these platforms and if you have anything you want us to discuss especially drop it in the comment section i have done that severally with many topics that we are given to me by you all and i'm grateful for that so i keep using it to explain to others this knowledge is good we share to everyone having said that if you are having challenges in your farm yes any challenges in your farm all you need to do is just do a two to three minute video send it to 081-353-48909 whatsapp only please now if for any reason you need to talk to me direct please kindly call me on the whatsapp don't call me on the landline i have many calls because since this is out people always reaching out to me and it's now becoming too much to handle. So I prefer you call me on the WhatsApp line. So once the WhatsApp line is on, I'm ready to answer any questions from you because, you know, I have other engagements. And if I'm now only fish, 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 and everything, it kills my other activities, which is not good. So I understand everybody needs prompt attention to his problem. And besides, this is a free service, so you should understand that Everybody wants, yes, but what you do is simple. Send me this message and I'll get back to you. I have been doing that and I'll continue to do that. So, I'll be back in a minute so that we'll discuss this. Yes, welcome once again. So, you know, like I said, the topic of this course today is how to achieve 1 kg body weight of fish in three and a half months. In three and a half months. So we are using 100 juveniles for this test run. Now, before I discuss this, I want you to understand something. If you want to do what I'm saying here now, I want to plead with you so that we don't have confusion anything you know before about fish drop it as you want to try this anything you believe you know about fish drop it if you are trying this please avoid going to consult people and doing what they say if you do that you won't achieve what i'm going to tell you now and when that happens please don't come back to tell me anything don't ask me that some don't tell because once you make that mistake and you are talking and we know that there is an error because everybody that i have told this they have 99 percent have come out with positive response so anybody that comes out of this 99 percent now is now making another mistake so i want you if you want to do it do it with an open mind. Remember, you are not giving me anything. You are not sending me anything to try. I'm not doing anything. Whatever I'm talking about here today is for you to go and try it on your own self. 
and see the result. I'm going to discuss further about people that want to do 1,000. But now, I want to limit it to 100. So even if you want to do more than 100, are you listening carefully to what I say? All you need to do is do multiples of this 100 to whatever you want to do. Simple. Now, the first step to achieving this, using 100, is you need a tank, a tapolim pond, or concrete pond, or earthen pond, that the measurement should be at least, meaning that it can be more than, but it cannot be less than 10 feet by 10 feet. You can use a pond that is bigger than that, but it can't be less than it to achieve this result. 10 feet by 10 feet. Best option, 4 feet height. Water level, 3 feet. If you have anything that suits this, it will do this experiment for you perfectly. Now, in case you want to do something below, let's say you want to do 50, it's very simple. All I have given now is to divide it into two. You get that measurement, use it to get whatever you want to do. And you want to do above this, do the multiples of this dimensions and it will work out. The tools you use to work, the feed that you need to budget to use and do this is 10 and 10 bags, 5 kg, or 10 and a half bags. Anyone you can. If you can get 10 bags, 5 kg, or you get 10 and a half bags. 10 and a half bags is 10 bags. The other one should be around 700 grams or so. So that's why I say 5 kg or 700, uh, not 700 grams, 700 kg, sorry. Uh, 7.5 kg, that's half bag. Or 5 kg, any of them can do. If you even want to use only 10 bags, fine. When it finishes, you will see it. Remember, everything I'm saying now, you, you are not giving it to me. You just buy, keep in your place. Get ready for the experiment. You may not even finish this number of feed because there are many reasons that have happened, but buy it and keep down. Go to a very good source and buy 100 juveniles. You may be afraid that some will die. You can buy 110. Don't buy 150. I did not say 150. You can buy 110. Max 120. Because you may be uh, targeted that some will die. Which if you don't manage it well, it may happen. But don't exceed for any reason 120. That one on top is even a problem. But it's okay. You can accommodate that. Remember what I said? Your pawn should be at least 10 by 10 for 100 fishes that you want to do. Don't use 10 by 8. I did not say so. I said 10 by 10. Feed that you want to buy is at least 10 bags plus 5 kg. Or you can buy 10 bags. But don't go and buy eight bags or you buy four bags and say you want to manage. Please don't tell me that. If you want to bring that story, don't even try it. So if you don't have money to do this, what you can do is reduce it. Do 50, do 60. Reduce the size of pond, go and do it. Don't start telling me that if you don't have money for it, then don't do it. Nobody is forcing you to do it. This is why most fish farmers fail. When you don't have money to for something, you want to go and do it. How can you not have money for? Uh, you don't have money to wear a cloth. You now go and collect the cloth. I say because people are wearing the cloth. Does it make sense? It doesn't make sense. And this is pure business. Catfish is pure business. Catfish is not that uh, you want to do it. It's business. So if you don't have money to do up to hundred, then divide it and do sixty. If you still don't have money to do up to 60, then divide it. You can subdivide and do 30. You can even do 20. You just want to experiment. Why I'm saying this is that some of us are very, very funny. I have said this now because the price of uh, juvenile is cheap. You will not go and buy 100 juvenile. And I say uh, you don't have money for the food that uh, you'll be using some other things. If you use some other things and get some other things as a result, please don't even bother to tell me.
I'm only saying this so that tomorrow, <laughs> because I have, that's the reason why sometimes I don't like giving out some certain figures on, on some certain teachers because I have had experience where I was trying to tell people what to do. They will go and misunderstand what I say and do practically what they want. And they now impose it that that is what I said. So when we now go and check back what I said, it will not be different. They will not say hey, they did not understand. But intentionally, they did. So now, what I'm saying now in effect is that if you get these things down, obviously you should know that, like I always say, fishes live 100% of their life in water. So you should have water. Now, get back to these pages. Check your feed sizes. That will guide you on what we're talking about. Of course, you should know that from juvenile to three and a half months, what we are supposed to use for this particular test is 3 mm, the maximum. Start from 1.8. You just buy half bag for 1.8 because of the number. Just buy half bag. Once they finish it, you buy 2 mm. Once they finish your 2 mm, will be used until they are three months before you go to 3 mm. Don't use 3 mm when they are two months. If you get all these things right, you will see your result. So like I said, you start with half bag of 1.8 mm by scratching 1.8 mm. So once they finish the half bag of scratching 1.8 mm, the next thing you are going to buy is one bag of scratching 2 mm when they finish the one bag of scratching 2 mm go and buy three bags of blue crown 2 mm depending on the month that they finish it before you will know whether you should buy 3 mm blue crown so if they finish it within two months you buy 3 mm blue crown but if they don't finish it within two months wait buy another two mm blue crown until they get to three months before you give them three mm blue crown method of feeding of this fish is you get to your pond that you have this fish be putting the feed for them gradually and they will be eating immediately they stop eating hold on hold on for like 10 15 minutes Try again. If they come, keep giving them. If they don't come, they are okay. Leave them. Change the water in this pond every two days. If you are using concrete, tarpaulin, change the water every two days. But if you are using a tin pond, no problem. You change the water just once in a month. So, if you do this by three and a half months, you may not have finished that bag of feed. You are hearing me right. You may not have finished it. It's not a must that that feed will finish. But there are instances. There are instances that your place, the temperature and everything will make them that when they get to three months, they will fire the food and finish it. But there are some places that will not finish it. When they get to three and a half months on the dot, carry your skill. Bring out your fish, put on your scale. You are going to see one kg. If you try this, you are going to see one kg. Anyone that did not meet up to that time, just give it to us. I mean, feed your fishes very well. With everything I have said, all the measurements I have said, you see the result. If you see the result, then let us know. If you don't see the result, then let us know. So if there's anything I have said you don't get and you want to ask, kindly drop it in the comment section. But like I said, I'm going to talk about those that we want to try it on 1,000. But if you want to try it with what I said now, I want to do on 1,000. Just do a multiples of the figures I gave. It will still give you the same thing. So until I come your way next time, I remain yours. Noel Oge and Melipon of Lettuce Farm. Keep farming. It's your